Hello everybody, back here again for another vlog a day, and today is Monday the 29th, and today was an absolutely gorgeous day again. Our weather cannot be getting any better than this. This has just been beautiful out. It's getting nice and cool in the evening, you're sleeping good, nice blanket thrown on top of it, the window's open, it's working out great. It's warming up nicely, you can be outside doing stuff. I was outside earlier today working, and I had a sweatshirt on, and I actually had pants on, which seems so weird this time of year. To be out working outside. I actually warmed up enough. I started building up a pretty good sweat, but didn't feel like going in and changing, so I was getting pretty close to being done. I did a bunch of yard work, ended up moving a bunch of bricks and stuff. I got a whole bunch of, um, I think they're like a siding bricks, what they would have been used for or whatever. I got a bunch of those for free here a while back. I did some landscaping with them. And I had them in the trailer, and I needed the trailer empty for tomorrow. Going to a produce slash flower auction for plants and trees and that kind of thing. And I wanted the trailer empty for that trip, so I went ahead and unloaded all those and I didn't know where I was going to put it. I originally picked them up when I was getting the, the little brick type siding things. I was going to just throw them in the ditch. But they're actually pretty darn sweet looking and they make a nice little edger for like landscaping. So I made a big you know pile out back. I've got two different colors, some gray and some red both. And I figure I'll go ahead and use some more around the house in different places. And just kind of, I don't know, see if I can use it. Worst case scenario, I moved them one extra time. I'll throw them in the wheelbarrow, take them up, throw them in the ditch. So... Hopefully I won't have to do that because I kind of like the way they look. They actually kind of lay down the way they're stacked. They're, they make a nice little sidewalk maybe even. So I might look at trying to do something like that with them. They're kind of funky looking. They're just a strange little deal. So other than that, it was out there and that seemed to be a lot of work. It's just a ton of work. I went ahead and I had a pallet full of them, like a big box pallet. So I went ahead and got that emptied out completely. Burnt that up and stuff. So it was just kind of rotten wood. Got rid of it all. And then I went ahead and went out to um, gym. Went and did some elliptical bike. It was trying to rain off and on today, so I didn't take the recumbent out and decided to go ahead and just take the um, the car over to the gym. Spent my time on the elliptical bike inside the gym instead of being outside riding around the rain. Never really rained hard. Rained off and on spits here and there, and it kind of sprinkled most of the day. It's kind of strange looking. Went for my run, uh, my little runner's world run streak. Went ahead and kept that going. Ran down by the ball field. They had the all-star game going on today, so there's tons of traffic down there. It's kind of interesting. It was still, again, trying to, you know, spit rain a little bit in that, but the game was still going on. They are actually starting up another game, and they had the game going to the smaller field. So the one cool thing at the run, though, I did find they have one of those little road signs out, like the little um, the radar for how fast your car is going. And I actually kind of ran over that side of the road and took off running right in front of it to see how fast. I could go in it and to see if it even picked me up. And it did actually pick me up. I came in about six mile an hour. No big deal. Ten minute mile. I sped up. And according to that thing, I got up into the 11 mile an hour pace. But I didn't actually look at my watch to see exactly what it was. So I'll have to go back and download my information later on this evening and see if I got actually up to 11 mile an hour or not. So that was kind of cool. I wasn't really running as hard as I possibly could because my toes are still kind of giving me some problems in that. And plus, I had I wasn't really wanting to get out there and hurt myself i've got a either tomorrow or wednesday i don't know which day i'm doing it yet i'm going to do an 18 mile run for training technically it calls for tomorrow but one day off won't make a difference in my life so that right there i've got to figure out what i'm doing with that exactly and go from there so right now i'm just out here in the shop you can kind of see behind me trying to get things organized getting a few things packed up i think i'm going to go to watch here this weekend if it looks like it will rain i might hold off because you pay the same freaking 45 bucks plus all the gas up there and back whether it rains or not and I don't I'm not gonna be inside this year I'm gonna be outside selling a bunch of stuff and I don't have a good carport type canopy something like that out there yet I have a small like little 10 by 10 I've got my trailer which I'll leave there and I can keep some stuff in it but I don't have enough tarps to cover everything and I don't feel like packing everything up every single time so I'm gonna try and scrounge up a couple more tarps I might rummage to Moin Wednesday if I go up there Wednesday I'll probably do my run up there but I haven't made my mind up completely what I'm doing yet so if I do that, I'll probably hit Harbor Freight and grab myself another tarp or two. Just kind of go ahead and, you know, have a spare. Never hurts. Maybe pick up a couple rolls of plastic and go ahead and do that as well. So, anyway, that's all I've got for right now. I'll talk to you guys tomorrow. Have yourself a safe and wonderful day. Thanks for watching.